episode of the button i thought i knew when they posted these things i thought i figured out it was every second friday and then they go and drop one on august 12th what even was that it was a friday oh but it had been one friday it had only been one week since the last one it's just like what what do you i swear to they're playing with me i was i was out of town on friday i couldn't even film it anyways let's get into it What's up? My How name's Drew, nice to meet you. Nice. Oh, this is the same girl. So this must have been the same footage. They're just cutting a second episode from it. Ah, I see. Nice to meet you. Well, how are you? What's I'm, your, I'm what's good. Up? This is awkward for you? Yeah, I feel like I don't really know how to start, but. Do you want kids? Do you, who, who, do you either of us? Kid? Do you want kids? Do I want kids? I don't want kids for like 10 years. What about you? I want kids. Like a family is like the goal I think. <laughs> That's awesome. Just polar opposite answers, just right off the bat. Yeah, I, ah, like a decade from now, I want kids today. I would love to be holding a human baby right now that is my own. I have baby fever currently. Feel my forehead. It's fucking hot, right? 100 degrees. Baby fever. Damn. Okay. I'm so, I'm sorry. That was kind of a tie, was it not? Nah, he got it first. Damn, she was like half an inch away. Gotta be faster than that if you're gonna play the button. Why don't these people like warm up in the green room, you know? Just sitting there like. <laughs> like a little speed bag. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry to the headphone users out there. I know people get pissed when I hit my desk, but it's kind of my thing. Damn, okay. I'm so <laughs> It's okay. Why did you press my button? This is awkward as hell. Um, I just don't think it was there. Hello? How's it going? Hi, I'm Drew. Nice I'm Julia. You. you have a great- That was a really good answer. People should just say that every time. I don't think it was there. That's a great, like, just kind of catch all safe way out, you know? Remember that guy that said, yeah, I just, she's just not cute. Oh my gosh, because I'm a creative person? No, I just, you're not cute, sorry. It's like, <laughs> say anything else than that, you know, whatever. That was in the old episode, you know? Why, do, why am I going back to that? Smile. Thanks, I appreciate that. Did you kill that leopard? Did you? <laughs> <laughs> um, don't call me a poacher, but I might have. Oh. Tyler Creator once said, don't trust a woman with a fake leopard. Okay, well, this is going really well. Yes. Yeah. Mm, see you on Bumble. Sorry. Kind of, kind of a sick way to exit? I mean, he destroyed her. He really did. He insulted her, what she's wearing by quoting Tyler, the creator, and then buzzed her. So I don't blame her for trying to like get a smooth exit, but was what she did cool though? You know, the, I'll see you on Bumble. What does that mean? Is that supposed to be like a diss? Like, oh, real life shit? You think this matters? <clears throat> I'll be chatting with you next week on an app for sure. Maybe they already matched. Maybe that's what it is. She recognized him and she's like, oh, we've been chatting and he still buzzed her for whatever reason. Maybe that's what it is. I'm gonna start ending, you know, Zoom meetings like that by, by saying that, you know, just to weird people out. Okay, everyone have their marching orders? All right, great. Well, uh, I gotta jump into another call, so I will see you guys on Bumble later. Bye, click. They're like, bye. Wait, what? What did he say? <laughs> Why did you reject her? I didn't like her outfit. <laughs> How are you? I'm okay. They talking bad about me in the back? So much. Oh, that's cool. I like your top. That's a, that's Thank a nice you. flannel. Okay, well tell me about yourself. What makes you so good? Not so much that I'm so good. I just like everybody. <laughs> it's just that everyone else is so fucking bad. <laughs> you know what they like, and I feel like we shouldn't waste each other's time. Okay, so what do you not like about me? Um, that's a very hard question. <laughs> what do you not like about me? At first um, glance, what do you like? Oh, glance only? You okay, the hat, the hat. What like the heck hat? is that, bro? It's cool. Um, it's affordable. The old distraction. He doesn't even realize it. He doesn't even know what happened. He's too busy being like, oh, come on, you're, you're, you can, the hat is cool, okay? The hat, the hat. You think this is a bass fishing shop hat? Sorry, Andrew. <laughs> Why okay. did you reject him? I didn't like his attitude. I didn't, what, like, it doesn't really have attitude. He was kind of just telling it like it is, you know? No, he really was. He's like, I don't want to waste anyone's time. But then again, it's like, it's like you should, like, that's the point of this. Nobody's wasting each other's time. 
It's like the what a con like a courtesy here would be to actually give someone a couple seconds. What's your name? Uh, my name is Taylor. What's your name? I'm Nicole. You brought him back. Yes, he's back. Let's see him lay some game down right now. Oh. Hi, Nicole. So what kind of hobbies do you do? I have an aquarium, a 55 gallon aquarium. Oh. <laughs> what if he was like, nerd? <laughs> an aquarium, weirdo. You're in a fish? Okay, I, 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 don't, I don't date fish girls, all right? <laughs> Someone like me, all right? I'm like a fox, I like eat fish. Don't bring me around that tank. <laughs> Uh, that's wicked. Nicole, are you not gonna address the elephant in the room? What elephant in the room? So, I am a furry. What? You? Oh my god! Yeah! Oh my god! Holy hell! You are! Uh, I had it. I didn't even. <laughs> I. I gotta be honest. Didn't even notice. <laughs> wow! That is. You are. You're wearing a fur suit. Oh my god! I gotta be more observant. Furry. The way that I describe it is a, f a fascination or a interest of animals doing human things. Talk is about it a sex thing? It is definitely not just a sex thing. It's not just a sex thing. <laughs> An interesting way to answer that question. Is it a sex thing? Well, it's not, it's not just, it, it, I mean, it is a lot of the time. <laughs> it, not if you're, just a sex thing. It's not. Have you had sex wearing that? Oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Yeah, I wasn't expecting <laughs> I knew they fucked in the suits. I knew they did. I knew it. It's just nice to have confirmation, you know? That really caught him off guard. He was like, I didn't, uh, well, I don't, I, uh. And she was able to sneak one in at the buzzer. <clears throat> He's like, fine. Fine, that's fine. You're never gonna get a piece of this. Bring your fish around me. Let's see what happens. <laughs> it was nice meeting you. It was nice meeting you. Or I guess he's like a wolf, not a fox, right? It's some kind of dog. Sorry. Ernie was quite a gentleman. He was a nice guy. I gotta give him that. He seemed like a pretty genuine dude. It was a little bit endearing how he got like nervous at the end. He was like, um, um, do we have sex in, in this? He was really nice, but yeah, I was just not into that. Hi, I'm Patrick. I'm Nicole. I'm Nicole. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Cool, so. So you're on a date. Patrick. Wow. Wow. This, wow. The silent killer. Didn't even say a word. Just sat down, just. Mm. Why'd you press me? He's like. Why did you press me? She was about my tie. Hi. I'm Patrick. Patrick? Yeah. Okay, I'm Jade. Jade. I have a question. Yeah. Um, are you the type of person to tell someone when they have something in their teeth? Um, great question. Great question. Why don't more people do that? Sit down and just ask them weird questions right off the bat. You have like two seconds, so might as well make it crazy and weird. Oh boy, yeah, yes. Yeah? yeah. Do you have something in my teeth? No, I don't see anything. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. That was so polite. Thank you. Yep. <laughs> wow, I've never seen someone get rejected as quite as polite as that. Why did you reject him? I think he was very soft-spoken. I'm Jade. I'm Jane, I'm Joel. He wasn't even, he wasn't spoken. He didn't speak. He hadn't yet spoken. You can be soft-spoken, but can you be hard-spoken? Joel. Jade with a D. Jade with a D, yes. I love that. So tell me about yourself. Jade with a D. It, could you spell that another way? Jade. It's pretty straightforward, right? Jade. Jade with a D. Wow, I like this. I like what she's doing. She's throwing me off. Tell me about you, about me. Um, I really like to dance. Prove it. <laughs> <laughs> I love, she was weird. That was, that's how you play that game. Just fuck around, do weird shit. That was textbook right there. That was so fun to watch. This, this could be my favorite episode of all time. So fun, why did you reject her? The dance moves just weren't it for me. 
My name's Joel, what's your name? Izzy. Izzy? I love your shirt, like, what's it? What's the inspiration behind it? I thrifted it and it was cute. Yeah. I love thrift shops. Wait, <laughs> like which one's your favorite? Do you have any? Um, <laughs> wow, put them on the spot. Oh really? Name three. There's one in, I forgot the name. I'm so, I shouldn't, it's like. <laughs> oh, and he's, he's fucking it up. You can't even name one. It's green. I forgot. They do, they do like, you know, they do like secondhand clothes there where you can like, you can buy stuff that's been worn before and you know, you can get a pretty good, a pretty good deal on it and be real thrifty. Boy. You're a good Christian boy. I try to be. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you reject him? Because of your religion. <laughs> He's a good Christian boy. Is that a problem? Absolutely. He's a good Christian boy and I'm a bad Satan bitch. That's what she should have said. Maven. Izzy, love your jewelry. Appreciate you. Love the earrings. Thank you. Do you guys find each other pretty? Uh, pretty? Pretty. You are pretty. Yeah, yeah, pretty buttoned. Yeah, I think you're pretty. Pretty rejected. You're pretty too. <laughs> I love your skin. It's like Thank glowing. You. You're like, yeah, love that. radiant. Are you into each other? I love your skin. I'd love, I'd love to wear it. Something happening here? <laughs> um, a conversation's happening. I know. I don't really know yet. Yeah. What's your sign? I'm a Capricorn. God damn it! Where's the button? Nope. Mm, nope. Yeah, Capricorn. Yeah. Uh, no, thank you. No, thank you. No, Capricorns, they are way too hot tempered and but they know what they want, but like they're also, you know, very personal and they could, they could, they have a softer side. But they are, they sometimes a little bit too strong willed. It's all that happens for me ever. Yeah. I'm grounded. That's all I know. Yeah, that's what you guys all say. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Get out of here. If you can't see past someone's sign on a first date, get out of here. What about like the person, the words, the the energy? Oh, your birthday was in what month? Oh, I do not fuck with people that are born in June. Why did you reject Izzy? If you're gonna like cut me off just cause of my sign, it's not someone who I necessarily want to date. Hi. Hi. Quick question. Yes. Do you like- <laughs> He's like, what's your sign? <laughs> I'm a Capricorn. Oh, oh, wow. Uh. SpongeBob. Um, it's all right. Are you attracted to each other? Uh, yeah. Hey. It was, it was, the button lit up and I was just- That's an easy way to say no. That was a pretty easy way. I was right, I was ready. I'm sorry. Hi. What's your name? Drew. Drew, I'm Olivia. Nice to meet you. I like your tattoos. Thanks. Those are dope. My best friend, she's a tattoo artist. Oh, dope. I want to get a chest piece because I'm Panamanian and I wanted to mm. like signify some of that stuff. Oh, yeah. cool. This experience has been like cool for you? Um, yeah, it's been pretty fun. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of, it's fun just like all of us like talking about yeah. everybody, so. What's your type? I mean, like, whatever. Honestly, like, I would say you. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you'd be like my type. That's dope. Yeah. yeah. I think you're cute. Thanks. Yeah, for sure. And I say cute because like, I feel like uh, beautiful would be kind of cliche. So I feel like as a whole, like you're very aesthetically pleasing to me. All right, man. Okay. I think you're the, just the perfect mixture of sexy and cute. Huh, yeah, thanks. Yeah, for sure. Once you're in a relationship, are you like in an open relationship? Are you like committee? Like what is the- Oh, if I were to be in a relationship, I'd want to just be monogamous. Okay, yeah. Yo, same. Oh, you're monogamy? Oh, word! I'm also monogamy. This person. I'm not really jealous. Person. No, I'm not either. I feel mm -hmm. like I provide enough for them to be comfortable. And if there's somebody that I should be worried about, then. Then they were never just, yours to begin with, yeah. right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're not. I'm not pressing the button. I'm having okay, a good time. Okay, cool. Yes. We're vibing. We're vibing. We're vibing. Oh, yeah. Okay. We're vibing. I feel that. Let's go. Did you go to college? Yeah, I'm still in school right now. How old are you? 21. I turned 22 Ooh, you're on a Wednesday. Baby. How old are you? Andrew's age preference is 21 to 35. Damn, I'm snitching. Yeah, <laughs> I went through a lot as a kid, so mm. like, I think maturity is based off experience, not age. So. Mm. I've migrated from a different country. You know, my parents sacrificed a lot, so it shapes you a certain way. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I was gonna do the same thing, no cap. No, really? No, to like pretend, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now we're good. Hit it, hit it, do it. Just hit it. That'd be so funny. I'm not gonna, just so you know, I'm not gonna hit it. It's like. <laughs>
I want the fucking furry guy just to walk through the background. You know? You gotta you gotta utilize that guy. It's a guy in a fursuit. Second date? I'd be down. Yeah? Congratulations. Woo! You have We all saw it. I love you. Face pumped. Oh, love you too. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, fantastic. Enjoy your date at Olive Garden. I hope that it's tremendous. Petition to do a blindfolded episode of The Button and the last couple gets to see each other and choose whether or not to press it. That's a good idea. Sarah, it's a really good idea. I hope they do that. I, I, I feel like, you know, the furry dude seemed like a nice guy, you know? I kind of hope they bring that dude back. I kind of hope they find another furry. That's what needs to happen. Do that, do Sarah's idea. But then also do an episode where it's only furries and it's a furry dating show. All right, well, I'm out. I'm out. Later. Freezing. Ah. Peace.